But I met with Roger and I sat down with him and I understood where he was coming from and he shared with me some of, uh, some of the innovations that he's working on. And I think the guy at the moment in terms of his thinking and where he is with his innovation is a step ahead, you know? And I feel it would be stupid to ignore someone like that if it uh, helps to use whatever he creates to make the entire space better. And that's where, you know, I want to come in as uh, a bit of a game changer because I know already that what I'm creating now is going to be used by hundreds of millions of people. I have no doubt about it. I've done it before. I've built super large sites, you know, about a billion people in the world have touched my numerous different websites that I've built. So all of my knowledge that I've gathered over the last decade is now in this product. And I know what users want. So I've created something that I think could be a killer app for crypto. And then I'm looking at the reality of crypto today, all this fighting, real innovation, not uh, uh, being recognized because of this fighting, because of the toxicity. So what I would like to do, if I get to a, a point of influence because we are bringing so many users into the space, I want to make sure that we look at innovation again. You know, that we look at what are the best ideas. And if you believe it or not, Roger has some really good ideas. He's working on cool stuff in terms of security, privacy, uh, you know, and I also agree with his argument that in order to be a very successful cryptocurrency, you need to provide fast uh, and cheap mm -hmm. transactions. There's no way around that. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's nice to be a store of value, but if you really want to succeed in this, in this game, you need to be the electronic cash. And now let me tell you something else. Let me tell you why I think that. Right now, only 2% of internet users have even been exposed to crypto. We are a niche, small piece of shit in the universe of business, all right? But this is going to change. A lot of new people are going to come into the space. We talked about the growth numbers that you are expecting each year. You think mm -hmm. that 16% of the internet population are going to use crypto in the next five years, right? Easily. Yeah. Easily. So where are all these people going? They don't know anything about the current wars that are taking place, the current toxicity, toxicity within the crypto community. They are going to go with the currency that gives them the cheapest fees, the fastest transactions, the most reliability. And currently, unfortunately, that is not Bitcoin. Mm -hmm. 